Well, hi there, everybody. Good Wednesday morning to meteorologist Travis Klineski here. We keep the nice temperatures around these next couple of days because uh, it was a nice day on Tuesday. But the big problem today and tomorrow, those winds, they are going to be much stronger out of the northwest. We actually have a cold front that's making its way through the area this morning. And uh, that's brought some clouds with it, even more than what we're seeing on future casts there. It's mostly cloudy across much of the area. No precipitation to speak of, though. Those winds are going to kick in, especially as the uh, we get a little daytime heating. Those winds will be out of the northwest. It, 15 to 30 miles per hour. Gusts at times up close to 40 miles per hour. Now we'll get a little more sunshine later in the day compared to the uh, morning hours. Winds actually stay a little breezy even overnight tonight. Clear skies. You know, because of those winds, it won't be terribly cold out there. 20s for lows. And then as we get into tomorrow, a little cooler highs in the low to mid 40s, but still very blustery. Those winds just as strong tomorrow as today. Maybe even a little bit stronger out there. Once again, winds out of the northwest, 20 to 30 miles per hour. Gusts at times up around 40 miles per hour. So again, a couple of days of uh, blustery, windy conditions. The wind should be a little bit lighter on Friday. Let's look at those highs for later on today. 40s up north, low 40s around Ainsworth, upper 40s farther to the south there. Northwest winds can sustain 15 to 25 miles per hour. We'll see the decrease in clouds through the day. Same thing out west. Stronger winds expected out west with upper 40s and lower 50s. Upper 40s to lower 50s in the south, partly to mostly cloudy skies, a little more sunshine later in the day, and those blustery winds out of the northwest. Wind's not quite as strong, but still breezy in the east, upper 40s to lower 50s. Another blustery day tomorrow, a little cooler out there. Friday, the ideal day for late December as temperatures push into the lower 50s, lots of sunshine. Back to around our average high on Saturday, a couple of extra clouds out there for the last day of 2016. A little bump in temperatures on Sunday, enjoy it. Because the last, that's the last of it for a while. We are going to see chances of snow moving late Sunday night into Monday. In fact, that may be our best chance of snow. And then still a slight chance uh, off and on Monday night into Tuesday. A couple of disturbances coming through. And those will send, send in reinforcing shots of colder air. Highs only in the low 30s on Monday. But look at Tuesday. Struggling to try to get to 20 degrees. It looks like Arctic air will settle in for much of next week. So even though it's going to be windy these next couple of days, take advantage of the nice weather while we have it. As for a nice, as of nice weather, uh, look at Nashville, Tennessee. This is, of course, where the Huskers are playing on Friday. Next couple of days looking pretty good. A pretty good chance of showers and storms this evening, though, down there in central Tennessee. And then a little bit cooler tomorrow. A cooler day out on Friday. In fact, Friday will be cooler in Nashville compared to us here in Nebraska. That said, not too much wind, plenty of sunshine. It'll be okay temperature-wise for that game. That 2.30 kickoff between the Huskers and the Volunteers on Friday afternoon. Again, that is central time. So there you go again. Weather looking pretty good for the next couple of days outside of that wind. Enjoy it while we've got it. So until next time, I'm meteorologist Travis Klineski. Hope you have a great Wednesday.